Hello gamers, welcome to Straight Razor Gaming, your one-stop shop for all game news, reviews, and let's plays. Fanboy and the Analyst coming to you straight from Razor Country, and welcome to Shenmue. Uh, another game that you've never heard of or played. I mean, I've seen the sequel here and there in GameStop throughout the years, Yeah, but that's about it. Okay, this is really exciting for me, because this is a, a, a game... Well, game series, I don't know really would call it a series, considering there's only two of them. But the third one's coming out soon, supposedly. So, I figured it'd be cool to get you caught up on these before the third one comes out, because I, I figured this would be something to be right up your alley, because you're really big into, like, Japanese stuff. And this the first one takes place in Japan. The ja the character's Japanese, so... All right. I figured it'd be something you'd be into. So, you ready to start this up? Oh, yeah. It just brings you right into it. So this is our lead character. His name is Rio. A Rio, my bad. It's a hard O. I was gonna say. Oh. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? What is that? Oh no! I was late coming home from school. Father will be so angry. Oh. <laughs> I forgot to feed the koi in the pond. Oh, oh no. Oh, now no. I feel bad. Gotta have that bitch. Do oh, son. I'm alright, but Hazuki sensei. My father? Oh, some shit's going down now. The music in these this game is super intense too. It's kinda why it has the kind of fan base it has, I think. I swear. <laughs> Japanese anime and video game protagonists just like have a lifetime supply of hair gel. Oh yeah, because of the crazy hairstyles. Yeah, like I mean it's snowing. I'm sorry, but with the weather your hair's gonna droop. <laughs> Fusa. Fusa. Real son. They rejected my entry to Tekken. <laughs> they weren't okay with it. <laughs> what company made this? Oh, uh, Sega. Uh, see, I thought so. Yeah, this it originally came out for the Dreamcast. Oh, uh, well now I feel dumb. <laughs> <laughs> so there's this guy. Father! Oh no. Stay Not the Agent you. Smiths. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, he's got himself some Agent fucking Matrix on his side. Where is the mirror? I've no intention of telling you. Actually really fluid for a Dreamcast cutscene. Yeah, th that's one of the things that I give this game top marks for. Like, I mean, yeah, I mean, they're nothing compared to the kind of graphics we have today, but for the, the time that they came, I feel like they, they age pretty well. You know, th their mouth no, movements are not endless gallons of nightmare no fuel matter. like Sonic Adventure, so I'll consider ask. this a blessing. I mean, you have to think, this came out around the same time as Metal Gear Solid. Yeah. And you know what that looked like. Oh, yeah. That'd be fun to play with you. Yeah, wouldn't that be original to your song? That'd be fun. Choke noises! Harder! Oh, no, I don't know if I just ended that kind of kinky shit. Now you made it weird! <laughs> now I'm just going I'm to kill your father and leave! No, he won't. Under the cherry tree. We have a cherry tree? Don't tell George Washington. John, that motherfucker down. Allegedly. <laughs> yeah, oh, allegedly. <laughs> I think it's so hilarious that that story Chow got passed Ming? around, but apparently Chow. there's no historical That's weight to it. the name of the man you killed in Moon Swan. It can't be you. Me. Get up. 
I'll allow you to die like a warrior. Mm. Well, that's nice of you. That oh. actually, that actually <laughs> is, that actually is with their culture. Because if you were, if he were to just kill him while he's down and unable to fight, it would be considering that he's looking at him like he's less than a man, less than anything. As you can see, they, they found the mirror. Mm. It's not really a mirror. It's like a talisman. I can see what that... That thing's made of pure jade. Yes, yes it is. Good eye. Shit's expensive. Uh, sir, your ponytail's clipping into your <laughs> hand. I don't know how I feel about that magic. And that's where you can see the... Uh, I mean, as of right now... Music, hey, I'm perfectly fine with it. Oh, yeah. I mean, even to this day, the clipping animations crack me up when they happen. Oh, yeah. they, they don't remove the gameplay for me or the take me out of the storyline. They just give me a quick little chuckle. Forgive me. For I have turned for into a mannequin. Leaving terrifying. <laughs> oh, jeez, that face what? is terrifying. Please. Nightmare fuel. Father. Oh, don't give me that look. Your you friends. know I'm teasing. <laughs> Keep friends. Those you love close to you. Uh, no. Father. No! no! <laughs> Had to fit that trope in. Now you can see. Alright, early in now. Can you understand why I like this game so much? Yes, it... Even if it does feel a little cheesy, it's awesome. No, that's what that's what I love about it, though, is that it is cheesy. So that's basically what this game is gonna end up being. It's your classic, just straight-up revenge story. There's not much later, or... I feel like I'm watching a really Bruce Lee on. movie. Yeah. Oh, I thought that was going on outside. Oh, yeah, no, that's actually part of the game. That's really good sound quality. Oh, they left her live. Uh, yeah, the only one that they killed was the dad. Sensei. Well, that was nice of them. And she just got a, they got a letter in the mail that was addressed to our father. Ooh. And came four days after. Oh. Uh. So is that band-aid on his cheek an aesthetic style choice or did I don't something... know. They never really put a backstory to it. I always people always wonder that. That's like one of the biggest questions in the fan. Are you serious? What's up with Why the is band -aid? the band-aid on his cheek? <laughs> That's the big heavy hitting question. Yeah, they want to know the story behind the uh, the band-aid. What's underneath the band-aid? Why it's another band-aid. Watch in the third one they reveal that it's some magical like something the band-aid will save the day yeah right that's what saves the whole that's what the whole saga is built upon the band-aid the band-aid of truth the band-aid of power <sighs> ah, scary dreams oh <laughs> he looks uncanny to All the right. main character of yu yu Hakusho. so this is our journal you can like turn pages with the D-pad, which is pretty sweet. Okay. And these this are all is, this phone is a, numbers. This is a nitpick. This is a nitpick, but I kind of wish that um, the notebook was reversed. Oh yeah. Okay, I get what you're saying. It's a nitpick. You don't nitpick the game pad. We literally just got into. I I know. I know. I just think that would have been neat. So. Oh jeez, uh, they're giving me an analog watch. Can't you give me a digital one so I actually can go. read it? So, in order to uh, interact with things, it's a little different. Uh, so, you have your commands down here. You see the buttons, uh -huh. like the circles. Well, in order to interact with things, because you could pretty much interact with just about everything. Like, they were really big in the whole immersion thing. But yeah. you have to actually use the L2 button to zoom in and then the X button to open shit up. It's a little, uh... And then I'm assuming if there's anything of interest, he automatically... It, it'll, it'll prompt you to do something. I believe it'll be the X button. 
but at the moment, I don't think there's really anything. To uh, isn't there it. something in the bottom drawer on here? In here? Wait, where? In the dresser. Over here? Yeah, I thought there was something in the two longer drawers. I might be thinking of a different... Uh, ah, pants, I see. Pants, I like those. Yeah, no. I don't think there's really anything for us to interact with. Yeah, here. those might have been an Easter egg. I don't know. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Go ahead and go out this door. Dear son, ah! You should she was waiting for us. Spooky bitch. Uh, I'm fine, really. And you? Are you alright? Mm, yeah, you yes. know, I just almost but died, I but that's busy. fine. <laughs> this shit was terrifying, man. Distracted. You should have been here. I understand. Oh, where were you? <laughs> <laughs> Yes. I know exactly how to solve this. Oh, Just run right up to away. people in the street, grab them by the shirt collar, shake them, you. and be like, Do you know who killed my dad? This is for today. We'll get answers. Oh, yeah, real that's quick. another thing. So, like, they already start us off with, like, a I'll good amount of money, but every, every day, day she gives us more money. You know Why? Sure. Because. Mom, you're gonna oh, get I'm broken, fun. die. I that's funny. You wanna hear the fucked part? That's not even our mom. Really? She's Thanks. just like the maid. Who are you? <laughs> She's like the maid. And she gives us money. No, no, here allowance take. <laughs> All right. Okay. So you ready for a uh, a cool little touch? So every time you the leave phone? the house. Oh, it's leaving the house. I thought every you... time you leave the house, he puts his shoes on, and then every time you enter the house, he takes them off. Yes, respect. That's cool. So we're gonna go ahead and. And go out about the town so we can give you a give you a good little brief tour about about that the hakuni residence uh i probably butchered that yeah you most definitely did it's uh 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 hazuki his okay. last name's hazuki okay see i only I got a, i only got a, a quick glance at it so i might have messed up the letters. and that's another thing like it's probably pretty jarring with the loading screens because they're so fast that you really don't get a chance but that's the only reason they're there is because back in the day the load times were horrendous for these games are these the uh, not are these yeah, i think maybe is this the fastest is probably in the dojo is this the fastest walking speed you've got or is there a oh there's test? there's a uh there's a sprint. Okay, I was just curious if that existed. I know there's no reason to at the moment. Yeah, no, right now I'm just trying to get you, uh, kind of just show you around where yes, everything son. is. Is everything okay? And kind of get the worry. basic uh, beginning fine. plot out of the way. I want to ask you about that man. Oh, oh that you please man. don't tell my father. He'd be uh, so disappointed. The man called Landy. What did he talk with my father about? Landy demanded the mirror, and then they threw me out of the dojo. Oh, that sucks. The black suits? Catch the names? I don't know. They came out of nowhere. I see. Thanks, Fukusan. If you remember anything at all, be sure to tell me. Ryo-san, why? What you gonna do? Ryo-san, where are you going? You're not going after them. I am. Please, don't. Look what they did to Hazuki-sensei! They killed my father, right in front of me. I will have my revenge. Jeez, usually students are all gung-ho in these kind this. of stories to avenge their For sensei. My father. Yeah, right. This guy's just like, I don't want to go on an adventure! Fucking pussy! Alright, so that noise means that they, uh... Something new in the journal? Yeah, they update the journal. Uh... So it's 500 yen. She gives us 500 yen every day in the morning. Well, I mean, that's that's barely enough to, like, ride a bus in this day and age, I'm sure. Yeah, but that most of the places you need to go, you walk to. So, like, there... That's a moot point, then! Okay! <laughs> yeah, no, uh, there's uh, there's just so many... I don't know, you'll see. It, this, ga this game is just... It's all sorts of bonkers. It's funny. Um... So let's see. We already went to the dojo and talked to Fuku-san. I'll get revenge on my father. Yeah, we established that. We'll establish With that a couple. Two exclamation points. We'll establish that a couple more times throughout this game. All right. Well, now we need to ask around uh, to see if anyone saw men wearing uh, black that day. That's all we have to go on right now. So that's basically all we have to go on. Is there was a dude 
He had some peeps, and they were they wearing black suits. Chinese wearing black suits. All right, so let's go ahead and <laughs> that sprinting animation though. <clears throat> makes him look pretty derpy and it's pop, pressure pop, sensitive pop, 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 so pop, pop, like the the fur the more you push down the faster he goes okay so let's go ahead and go down to so this is the uh the path that leads up to the house there's no other way to do that there is like no way i see so you live out in the middle of nowhere yes and then this is the entrance to the town. Hmm. It's been a minute since I played this, so half the stuff I'm probably gonna have to try and remember myself. Hi, Megumi. Uh, you got a kitten in there? You promised not to tell my mommy. She said she was gonna cook it up and eat it! Sure. Oh dear, okay. this child I'm looks like... Uh, I'm gonna call you Boo. I wanted to name her Sal. Mom sister? called her dinner. It's <laughs> <laughs> so mean. Yep. See, the other day when it rained, a car ran over her mommy. Why are you telling me my this? My sister saw it. She said it was a big black car. A black car? Yeah, and she said it was really scary. And then me and sis, we buried the mommy cat. And so now, I can be the kitty's mommy. This, but this game is just depressing. Keep the kitten at home. I just asked her if there was a cat in the so box and she told me all this crap. Yeah, I didn't need the backstory, bro. Especially one so depressing as that. Like hey, Koda? I know how you feel. Yasuo? My dad's dead. <laughs> it happened four days ago. Got his ass handed to him pretty, pretty harshly. They were gonna kill me, but he's like, no, don't do I wanna it. die instead. So really, it's kind of my fault. Hmm. This little girl's just kind of looking at him like, uh... Have fun with your uh, new orphan cat. Okay. Bye. What the hell was that about? Oh, we got him. We're gonna have to make a choice here. So do we give it dried fish or fried tofu? What what do you want to give it? I'd give it dried fish. Sounds like it would be better for a cat. <laughs> just give it the tofu tofu. Just looks at the You would fucking kill the cat. <laughs> oh well, good job, Pat. We're off to a good start. So it's easy. You moron! There was cyanide in that fried tofu! <laughs> Good job, you chose correctly. High five. What happens if you give it the fried tofu? Just I don't know, I've never given it the fried We're tofu because I'm not a fucking idiot. <laughs> it's so sad. Yamagi-san almost got ran over too. Yamagi-san? Why are you still- What? His car was going so fast, he got shocked and fell. And hurt his backside, so now he stays home all day. When I go to the candy shop, I always stop by to visit him. Okay, so... We gotta go. You'll, yeah, you'll take us to the candy funny. shop? Megumi, you need to be careful around cars, too. Yes. Well, I've got to go now. But, but it's wait, been fun now, we but gotta I've think got of a name for go. the kitty. Oh, well, when I think of a good one, I'll let you know. You promise? No. Bye bye, y'all. Bye bye. The way he says bye is great. Bye bye. I just imagine him pointing a gun at someone in the face. Bye bye. Dude almost got hit, so we gotta go talk to Yamagishi san. Who is near the candy shop. Yeah. So if we go so on we our way go towards into the town to yep. Sakuragawaka or whatever the fuck. I'm not good at names like this. So chances are I'm gonna butcher a lot of these. I'm Sakura sure someone Goka? will probably Sakuragoka. I fix think. it in the comments. So I'm trying to remember exactly where homeboy lives. I think it's around this way. I don't know, but those those chicks looked like they were straight out of the Real Housewives oh, yeah, of Japan. I can't exactly Excuse me. Yes. What's this name plate say? Um. 
It says Kajima. Does it? I'm trying to find the Yamamoto's house, but see my eyesight is bad, so... Don't worry. I'll look for it. Wait for me in that park. For her. You're so kind. Thank you so much. Yeah, no. I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you the uh the, the last time I played this, I was kind of an asshole and I didn't help her. So this time we're gonna do that. But yeah. that'll be next time on Straight Razor Gaming. We will finally actually get into the bare bones and the meat of this game. I know that this was a lot of just video and then us just doing a lot of slow walking and talking, which unfortunately, I mean not really unfortunately, I like it. it probably won't be able to uh, it'll probably be hard to digest for some people, but this does have a fan base, and I'm kind of hoping that uh, the viewers will like this. How are you feeling about it so far, like the whole style of it? I like it. All right, well, but until then, remember, nothing is true, everything is permitted. Stay quark-tastic, and may, may your heart, heart be your guiding key. key.